Are you guys ready to see it so far? Welcome to my channel. I'm Amore Antasia and today is my first video of the new year. Yes, I know that I'm late, but I've had a lot of personal issues, family issues, and everything. I even had a funeral this week, so there's just been a lot going on, but I have finally updated my closet room slash IKEA Pax wardrobe DIY project that I did in my previous video. Thank you guys so much for supporting that video, sharing it. Keep sharing this video because I'm telling you, this closet is a money saver. So many of you guys were telling me, oh, it's not gonna work. It's going to fall. You can't put clothes in there. And so a lot of, um, a lot of other people were saying, you know, could you please update us? Let us know what the clothes will look like inside of it. But honestly, all together, along with some of the things that I shopped for at Hobby Lobby, like the acrylic drawers and, well, acrylic um, uh, containers and stuff like that, makes the whole thing look like Ikea-ish, you know? So this video is going to be slightly vlog style because I want to show you guys the literal update of the closet and also on this other side of my closet room where I updated my background. I did. So I'm going to show you guys where I got everything and if you just want to go to the description box, you can check that out. I'll post all the links that you can go to shop for all these items. I've been doing a lot of moving and shaking. I've been doing some traveling, but in my spare time, I've been able to upgrade my channel as a whole. So with this video, my quality is a bit better if you look at previous videos of last year because I've taken a class at Skillshare where they teach you photography ins and outs. So aperture, ISO lighting, you know, how to work your DSLR, DSLR camera, which is the digital camera that I have. And I talked about this in depth in my previous YouTube slash influencer video. So if you want to check that video out, you can for direct links to the products that I use, like for my filming setup. But Skillshare classes are so helpful. Like it's just a one-on-one -on -one type of community where you can actually talk to um, qualified teachers on the subjects versus, you know, YouTube where a lot of people will just ramble for like 25 minutes and then you get to the end of the video and there's literally no information. So with Skillshare, you can just go on and you know learn anything from photography, videography or cinematography. They also have like arts, they have cooking classes, they have tons of different categories that you can select classes for and it is totally affordable. So I did partner with Skillshare to create this video, well, to update you guys as well. They were kind enough to give me a free trial. And if you would like a free trial, you can check the description box below for the free subscription trial base. But it's so cheap. It's like $10 a month or less than $10 a month. And then if you want to do like the yearly subscription that is, you know, affordable as well, you can try that option. But for me, I love to do more so like photography and, you know, videography. So... I just used the videography classes and then I'm going to go on for another class that I saw that's coming. Well, it's already on there, but I want to upgrade my Instagram look. So shout outs to Skillshare for helping me with some of that to take that load off of my shoulders. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this video. Okay, so I got some stuff from Hobby Lobby and Target. So I got this for my jewelry and my watches basically so that I could, you know, keep that up and make that look like, um, an actual wardrobe system. And then I got this from Hobby Lobby. This is just a jewelry holder. It has the rings here, and then the loose jewelry pieces, maybe like bracelets or something can go there. And also more bracelets and, you know, let's see, bracelets and watches can go here. So this was only $7.99, and this was $8.99, I think? Eight, something like that, seven or eight. Now I tell you what, I had a coupon for 40% off. So yeah, make sure you go to HobbyLobby.com for coupons. I also got these acrylic trays from Target. I got them from Target. These were, I think this one was like $13. How much was, it was like 13, I'm pretty sure. And this is, you have to measure them. This is a 
two inch by 12, so two by 12. And so this fits perfectly inside of there on the side. So this is gonna be for my watches and everything like that. And not watches, these are gonna be for my belts. I'm gonna put my belts there and maybe some more jewelry pieces. Yeah, $7.99, $5.99. Oh, okay, this was $5.99, the bottom part. So I also got two long trays because I want to put more of my scarves or belts in these, kind of like the Ikea pack system does. And these were like $5.99 a piece, I think. You could get the long one for 20, but I couldn't find one that was long enough to fit the whole thing. So I might have to put them in a separate way, but I'll show you guys that in a second. But I just wanted to show you guys that I got them. So I got some portrait pieces, you know, just nice artwork from there. This is a scripture. I love positive affirmations in my room because it's just positive, duh. So this one says girl boss, like my mom. And she is the girl boss and it's pink and feminine with gold. I'm not too pink. Uh, my favorite color is red. I guess it's more masculine, but I wanted to spice this room up to make it look a little bit more like a safe haven, like a little fancy, bougie little place, the bourgeois abode. All right, so starting with my accessories trays, I might as well put them in. So this is my YouTube plaque. I'm gonna do another video separately for the t official tour. But I'm just setting some stuff up. teddy coats these are from express and target and a few dresses so i'm just hanging these up this is going to be where my coats and everything hang really heavy you know these coats are definitely heavy and then i have my blouses some of my blouses from boohoo and it's like the blazers they're really nice Check these out at Boohoo. I'm gonna link them in, in the description box of my try on hauls where I promoted these. I got this from Express. This is a really, really cute little piece right here. It's just a nice little blouse with the gold. And then I have some really cute body suits that are gonna go on the top over there from Boohoo. These are like less than $20 from Boohoo. So check out my try on hauls. And this is a cute little wrap piece from I think Shein or somewhere. And then I have another blouse. I guess my blazer can go over here too. Yeah, totally. Yeah, this is perfect. So this still looks good. Um, I'll put some of my blouses. I'll put my short blouses over here. I'll put my short stuff over there. And then actual blouses over here. Like camis and stuff like, so like my camisoles and stuff like that can go over here. Like shorter tops and then body suits and longer pieces can go here or since this is a nice little drape here I could actually still just go with this being over here and it works it looks just like the Ikea packs like the Ikea packs sometimes sticks out if you have the 13 which is the the 13 inch depth which is not that much because these hangers are 17 inches 16 to 17 inches so you're gonna have like a couple inches that hangs out regardless so this is much cheaper than fifteen hundred dollars it's like 150 all together with the bars and everything let's say 175 but you know I'm gonna where are my belts I have a lot tons 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 of stuff I have a whole bunch of Zara try on hauls and stuff that I have to do and update you guys with so I have more blouses from pretty little thing and like Marshalls and I have some pants from Express. I love these. So for my pants, I decided to put my pants, I don't want them to drape. So this is this is a good place for my pants that are, actually they can fit. I don't know why I have these like that. Let me adjust that. So I'm gonna put some more, I just, let's see how this goes. Okay, perfect. Okay, uh, is this a blazer? Yeah, it is. I mean, it is a blazer. It's a beautiful white blazer. From Boohoo, I'll just put that here. Okay, this is a short top, so this can go over here. This can fit here, like short tops. 
what goes in here? Underwear? I don't know. But this is gonna go over here. More shirts. I could actually hang my pants over here if I were to make them like a little more even like this. I could hang my pants up here, or I prefer to have my pants at the bottom though. Like now they don't drape. You see now, they don't drape at all. And these are high waist pants, so that's perfect for there. So I have a bunch of cute stuff from Target. These are like brand new, all of these are brand new. I'm gonna do a Target haul. So for the sake of this video, I'm gonna take everything out, but I want to show you guys, these are basics from Target. They look like Zara pieces, but they're totally from Target. Of course, I'm a repeat offender. I had to get them in black. I just got this last night from Target. This is so grunge and cute. This is so 80s. So, and I'm an 80s baby, so I have to have some cute little classic pieces. No! No! Okay, so this is gonna go here. These dresses and everything. And it's still like, like it's not going anywhere. Not going anywhere. Now, the fact that I don't have this into, you see how it can move? But you see how that's not, that whole unit is solid. It's not moving. But this is, because this is the one, I didn't secure it enough, but I don't care, because it's just my house, I don't care. But it's still solid, like nothing's falling. And I didn't, like, this isn't my house technically, so I can't, I don't want to put it in the wall. Plus I have neighbors. This is the Gucci, this is the Uchi from Shein. So this is it, cause I didn't, I couldn't even find the smaller one, the small Gigi belt. So I said, why not save $400 or $300? And boom, get this one for 10. So, I'm gonna put my Uchi belt over here. The Gucci belt actually can fit in this one. Wait. If I wrapped it up smaller, I could totally fit it in here. and then put this one behind it and then keep this one for like more fragrances or something like that. You know, if I wanted that, but I don't think I'm gonna do that. I'll just put them in a, put them in a, like that. So I have tons of body suits, you guys, from Boohoo. This is a cute one from Boohoo. Really cute. I love the uh, drape detail. And then I just have the regular tops from Boohoo with the drape detail. It needs to be ironed though, like badly. I'm gonna put these over here. Oh no. Don't you hate when it happens at the store? And then I have this top. And then I have these satin, well not satin, they're like mesh silk detail type of um, body suits as well. Like with the mesh. Uh, no, what is it called? Chiffon, the chiffon, chiffon blouses. And then this is the one over here, body suits. Oh, it's kind of color coordinated, but I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so this is what the closet looks like with a bunch of clothes in it, or just, you know, for now. I have my bottoms over there, tops up the top, longer items over here, and then some accessories in the middle where I'm gonna be filming. I'm gonna reorganize all of that. I have some accessory pieces down here in the little glass, and this is just gonna be the organization for now. I'm gonna do another vlog where I'm actually organizing everything, color coordinated, and just putting all my accessories and shoes up. Some of my shoes are gonna go at the bottom, but most of them are gonna go on another shelf that I have, a bookshelf that I built already. And it's gonna have, so you see how I have one, two, three, four sections? Well, I have those extra over there, the extra shelves. So I'm gonna go and take, I'm gonna take the last bookshelf, not this one, but the last one that I have over there, and I'm gonna put it over there on that side of the wall, and then I'm going to put them like this so that my shoes can go. I'm gonna put one here, cause let's see. All right, so yeah, I'm gonna put one here. Wait, I can put one here. 
another one down here and you know I could possibly have all of my high boots down here and then just put more up top for my actual shoes so keep that in mind if you have an extra one you can do that as well stay tuned for part two